very tough opponents. Um, we played Birmingham Southern on Friday night, uh, traveled over to Birmingham, and I thought the boys played very well. Um, Birmingham Southern is a very hardworking team. Um, they made it very, very difficult. Their goalkeeper had some unbelievable saves to really kind of keep them in the game. Um, and we've got to learn to put teams away. Uh, we created a lot of chances, some of the most exciting soccer that I've seen us play. Um, but credit to Birmingham. Um, they were organized um, and they, they made it difficult and we didn't put the game away. So I think they were happy with the point. Um, I think we were happy with the way we played, but thought we you know should have gotten three points on the night, but that, that's okay. Um, the Millsaps game, we knew it was the number one team, um, us playing uh, Millsaps number two. They're a talented team, very uh, senior laden team, um, lots of talented seniors. And it was, uh, we knew if we won that game, we clinched the league. So to, to go out there and execute, um, you know, two goals in the first half um, away from home on their senior day was, was exciting. Um, and, and to know that, you know, going head to head against, uh, you know, arguably the, the other best team in the conference and, and taking points at their place was, was exciting. And I was happy for the team. Um, Barry's another, uh, it's our in-state rival. Um, uh, they're, they're well coached, they have some good players, and, um, and we're playing at their place. So we're gonna treat it as we do every single other game that we, we have. Uh, we go out there with our game plan. Uh, we try to impose our will, our possession style game on the, on the opposing team, and hopefully we execute. It, we, we know it's going to be a hard test, but we, we go, uh, we're trying to get out there and, and, and sweep the league um, and, and prove that we're the best team in the conference. No, I, I think the approach is the same. Um, I think that we were unfortunate to. Uh, uh, to be the number one seed playing the number eight seed last year, Swanee, and you know I think we outshot them 33 to three, and, and unfortunately it just wasn't our night. We didn't we didn't put the the team away when we had the opportunities, and you can lose games like that. And um, heading into this year, I think that taste is still in a lot of our returning players' mouths. Uh, that bitterness of being the better team, not coming out on top, and really being shortchanged um, with regards to the NCAA committee. And I think that we know that we can punch our card to get to the NCAA tournament uh, by winning the, the, the conference tournament. So I hope that our boys come out with an edge. I hope that our boys uh, come out with uh, you know, the right chip on their shoulder with something to prove. And, and uh, Hendricks will be a, 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 a tough team. You know, every, Anybody in our league can, can beat anybody else on a given day and we respect their, um, you know, their coaching staff and their players uh, just like we would anywhere, anybody else. And, um, the exciting thing is we don't have to travel and we get them in front of our home fans and it's always a fun place to play. Uh, but we'll, we'll approach it with uh, a little bit of grit, um, hopefully the same quality that we show up with every day and uh, impose our will upon them and get the result.